James Robertson of Syncom Systems. I thought this morning I'd show you what web development looks like when you have truly productive tools. So let's go to the Parcel Manager, and I'll mention this is in the upcoming 7.6 version of Syncom Smalltalk. And I'll go here to Seaside Web Development. We'll have a new category. And I'll just load the Seaside package. And that'll take just a moment to load in. And when it does come in, you'll notice the browser pops up and brings me to the examples page. And I can go over here and I have the counter example. Now here's the interesting thing. Let's go ahead and hit that and let's move that out of the way for a moment. Because I want to go here and browse class WA counter. And let's go ahead and find, after I make this small enough you can see what I'm finding. Let's go ahead and find the increase method. Now there it is. Let's go ahead and hit plus. Notice that it works. Let's come in here and before it executes and we'll put a breakpoint. Let's go ahead and hit plus. Notice how the browser pauses. Now unfortunately the window doesn't pop to the front but it is in process here. So let's go ahead and take a look at this. What we can do is let's change this to plus five while we're executing it. Tell it to remove the probe, then go ahead and run. Notice how it took effect immediately. And that's because in Smalltalk, when you're in the debugger, whether you're in client server development or in web development, you're operating on the live patient. This makes things much more productive than operating in forensic pathology mode like you do in most environments.